Shout out to everybody, of course, watching in the stream. Three out of five. You guys uh, make it all possible in addition to the people in this room. Some of my favorite people in the world. Incredible amount of love, understanding. Uh, these are games about punching each other in the face. But to be truly excellent at them, you have to have a lot of empathy uh, and a lot of dedication. And there's a lot of respect for the dedication on display here. There's a lot of empathy to win at these games. You have to be able to see into the mind of your opponent. So empathizing with people, ironically, is one of the keys to success at Face Puncher. And now <laughs> we've got DM, Mad Cats, Shen, representing Gen, a character that many did not have faith in. He put him on the map up against Japanese god of fighting games, Mad Cats Tokido. I don't want this to end. <laughs> the crowd cheering along with the air fireball sound. <laughs> How do you type that out? We need to get that trending on Twitter now. <laughs> and again, Ken and Shen playing again. Really stuff there. Must be able to weather the storm. It's going to be a test of patience. Kuma with so many advantages in that air power. Oh, oh, ouch! That ow. just, ugh, that's yeah, crispy. Normally you only get a tiny bonus on counter hit, but that move, I think it's like 50% bonus. Yes, it's a massive damage move. Okay, here we go, Vortex time. No Vortex, brilliant dash back. It's gonna take it. Tokido is a huge fan of that standing roundhouse pursuit. Shen, gracefully dancing out of the way, punished for the kill. This is the match right here. If you can look inside and find a way to weather the storm, be patient, find the right opportunity, don't try and force it. Tokido with a chance here. Finds the throw. Got him in the corner here, but he's going to sacrifice it for the mix-up. Shin gets away. Takedo, of course, say battling from the loser's bracket. He will have to defeat Shin twice. Yep, six games. We've seen it happen so often here at Evolution 2013. And I love that. I love that slight pause on the jump. Oh! And here's the pressure all over Shen. Oh, the sneaky low hit. Oh! He exits with a hard knockdown, teleports away. It can be very difficult again to deal with. And again, that patience. Will he force it? No. He says, I'm happy backing off. That's fine. And I love it. I can't get over this audience chanting along with every air fireball. Audience, you're cracking us up. We're trying to focus on this match. And I'm, yeah, this is... I know this is not the, you know, the high wire. Well, to me, it's a high wire act. At home, it looks like a guy throwing a fireball and a guy standing on the other side of the screen. It's an extreme test of mental patience. Oh. Double dash back, and again, Tokido finding that just jump back fierce. You thought it'd be a fireball? Guess what? Yeah, of course, Jim, we saw earlier in the winner's finals was the one who knocked Tokido in the losers. But in three out of four games here at Evolution so far, we've had bracket resets. Let's see if Tokido can make it four out of five. It's just a strength that shows the caliber of these players. Even guys who've been knocked into the loser's bracket, able to knock out. That's called determination and will, pure will. Guts, no guts, no glory. Can't find, oh, good opportunity, throw, throw. <laughs> Double whip. Pushing him towards that corner, and Tokido finds his way out just like that. Situations are reversed. Wow, went for kind of a frame trap uppercut. Getting out of the corner, willing to take that low fierce. Good counter. Now again, in that scary position, one super is going to give Yen potentially the win, because he not only does he have the super, but he's got the ultra all lined exactly. up. Exactly. He's got a lot of options here. Tokido being a little more careful. Fireballs aimed straight down. Yeah, and doing it low in his jump. Yes. So that it no opportunity to slide under and confirm. It can't be react. It's not yeah. a reaction. It's a prediction right. now. But now again in position. Could you be looking for Ultra Two here? Or excuse me, the kick Ultra. Oh, here it goes. Tuesday went forward. Is this gonna kill? Akuma with relatively low damage. Going to be very close. Gives him a huge life lead. And now Shin is trying to use up time and getting chip damage. Clock now his friend. Ten. Critical game one. The low strong Takedo must create. And there's the offense. He eats it in the air. Okay. He survives, but then gets hit. Into two seconds. Cut. One. One second. Zero, it's not going to be out. And Shin steals that one. 
top of the forward EX air fireball. He dashed forward, got under both of them. And what I love is Shen's patience being rewarded. Yes. Not getting flustered. This is one of the big powers of Akuma. Why he's so dangerous and such a strong tournament character. He can wither you into making mistakes by getting overexcited about approaching, trying to find a way through the air fireball. A bit like Morrigan in NBC that we've seen. Uh, it's a standard turtle character tactic. Dalsim. Yes. Try and keep Dial. you on the outside. Uh, until you uh, make some unforced errors trying to get in, which are easily predicted. Okay, good throw from Tokido. Got to get a little bit of momentum here. Good chase down. Ooh. Very difficult for Gen to react to that, but he does now have the ultra. Yeah, so he might have been able to chase that down. Ooh. Just Caught barely here with that great empty jump from Tokido. Going for the reset. Ooh, gets away with it. Burns the meter to follow this up. Keep the pressure going. Oh, that is going to be... And not only that, but he's still close to being dizzy. Oh, wow, an autocorrect uppercut. Crazy. Oh, just going for that throw again. Dashing out of the way. Takeda's habits now maybe catching up with him. <laughs> Got to remember to breathe here. Oh, like a scalpel that was. The low strong, just in there. He calmly walked up, no dash. Calm approach. Uh. No, no, no coincidence that Xian right now a surgeon with Gen. And look at this damage that he's gonna get here. He has enough meter for another good combo, for an FADC combo. Again, Takedo here. In the same way we saw him sort of put on his heels by Shen in the last time they met. Just like he said, oh, wow, got behind him. Great pressure. And again, Shin with that super build up. One touch is going to be it in the sofa, and Shin is up 2-0. This is a match. This is tournament game. This is Evolution 2013 point. As you've seen, as you've said, as many in the crowd feel, this is Shen's year. He this is, is his time. He He's been, put in the work. He's been having the craziest year. And you know what? How many people out there would have picked, you know, before obviously Shin went on a rampage, but Ken exactly. with the potential to win Evolution 2013? We've seen Evil Ryu, we've seen Hakan, we've seen it all. Oh, wow. Oh, this gutsy stuff, I like it. Oh, tricked him, came down from the front, and then the cross oh, no. is going to be a dizzy here. Oh. And he does it off the overhead. overhead to so get... he's going to get max damage. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. I don't want to yell. <laughs> I can't help it. I know. <laughs> match, right. tournament, evil, 2013 points right now for Xian. And again. The composure, he's got to be excited. He's got to be on the edge of the seat. Must stay in the game. Brilliant stuff. Great trade. That's exactly the trade you want. Dashing back, not over committing. I love it. He's not over aggressive in these situations. He's content to sit back. He says, Tokido, you're not really doing anything. I'm not fooled by your false threats. Nice. Tokido trying to weather that momentum that Jim has with that uppercut there. Ooh. Oh, possible follow up. Oh, Sweet. brilliant counter poke. Here's the demon flip. Kito loves that setup. From the front. Oh. All right, Big some, damage. some potential overhead. Oh, oh, and a quick counter. He said, you know what? You're going to try to overhead me, so I'm just going to jab you in the face. I love it. And he can still win this round with one combo in the super. Takito. Oh. Aggressive with those dashes. Tokido stays it off, and now it is whew, tournament points. Still two tournament points for Shin, and he's gonna start with all this super and meter. Full super. He can drain Tokido down about half life on one hit right at the start of the round. Boom again without much damage. He's going through. Sails right through the fireball. Half damage. Who was I kidding? This is more like two thirds damage. And here we go. Oh, he got Shin against. Is it gonna be a P? Oh, nice runway. Okay. The pressure. Oh, oh too far. Tokido. 
So Kido, though, now he has a lot of meter. Wins the knockdown. Oh, baits it out. Oh. Changes timing a little bit. Oh, so Kido screwed it up. Hits him. Hits him. Oh, block. oh, here we go. Oh, he didn't juggle. Oh, no. oh the throw. And here we go. Oh, down to he this. He's going to cross up in the hands and try to chip him. No. There it is. Next hand. So Kido fighting for his life. What does he have left? Oh. oh. Final pixel. That's oh, yes. the frog in the hands confirm. Xian has taken it, and there is his country teammate Z. Up there with a huge hug, Singapore, your Evolution 2013 champion with Gen. This was his year. Tokido, no stranger to championships. This is my time. This is my time down here. Xian from Singapore. They have been wanting to put themselves on the map, and Z has talked about Xian yeah, for so long. Before he started being everyone like, again, he came out like and said, you know like what? That. You will, you are not ready for my well, get. Really you are not Xian ready won. for uh, Shin's get. Yeah. And everyone's like, what are you talking about? Gen can't possibly win tournaments. And here it is. Shin proving that the impossible can happen. Gen is going to take it. Dreams do come true. Look at him. Looking up at the sky. He can finally release, relax, breathe, try and assess the reality. We're assembling the competitors on stage for the award ceremony. Incredible stuff. Anyone at this point in your life, just this kind of achievement at this level, you there is nothing in competitive gaming like like an open tournament like this. You don't think winning EVO like this changes your life? This will last you for the rest of your life. At some point in time, you know you bested 1,600 people who entered the same game that you played. You are on top of the world. There's nobody better than you at this moment. And, and for me, tournaments always... I think the lasting value, of, as someone who competed for a long time in tournaments, what really stuck with me is I came to know myself inside. Yes. You know what you're capable of. You know where your limits are. You see your weaknesses more clearly, especially to be able to compete at this level. So I, I felt like I came away with a huge amount of personal understanding and came to be at peace with some of my uh, early aggressive and angry sides. Yeah. Uh, and I think, yeah, so that's, that's the kind of thing that you can't, Pay for All right. I, I learned I'm the top eight. one salt. Super <laughs> three for eight. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't work for everybody. <laughs> Let's give a big and hand to our champion. In seventh place, that give it up for Madcat. The, line the up beat. Right there. That is. There you go. Omahara again. You could take the rest of the eight. world Street Fighter skills, combine them together, will not overcome these also eight players place. combined together. Standing on the Incredible stuff. Congratulations, last year's second place finisher. This year, this is his third top eight. In fifth place. This always reminds Stop me of the, the scene okay. from uh, Star Wars, the presentation of the medals. <laughs> except instead of Princess Leia, we have uh, Chris Star Lee, a.k.a. Shrek. Da -da -da. And again, we've had trending. Tokido at number four, Infiltration at nine. Shin at five and probably rising. And Evolution 2013 at five and also probably rising. And shout out to Pia Bauer, played the out of his life two years in a row. Third place last year, fourth place this year. I feel his place doesn't reflect his actual yeah, play yeah, this year. Yeah, yeah. It was just incredible stuff. Infiltration. Infiltration again. What a show. Strong. What a show. You know, I mean, even though Shin won this, he's still, you know, in the running for best Shin's player in the place. world. Representing Madcap. Easily. It's Tokido. And listen to the audience chat. Tokido has been a popular favorite here in the States for years. He knows how to put on a show. The crowd First loves him. Place. Representing Mad Cats, the new world champion, it's Chad! Look at that smile on his face. And there's the flag. Applause for all the competitors. It was a great final. Singapore. You know, Those guys have put on basically a lab. They've got a lab of, like, killers that they've been training. They've been touring around the world. You don't think evolution changes your life winning a tournament like this? Talk to Shin tomorrow, and, and, and you'll know exactly what this means to him. And we can give him a few weeks. Let it settle in. Sure, no problem. <laughs> Just immediately his life has instantly changed. We got to keep it together here. This is this is uh, this is a pretty special moment for us. Uh, seeing somebody 
rise to, to this kind of achievement in uh, front of people that mean so much to him and uh, so much to both of us as well. This has been the most ridiculous year. I, You know, I've been saying this all weekend long to so many people. The, the blow up from 2008 to 2009, very expected. Yes. But from 2012 to 2013, this explosion that we've gotten between Another the two years is for all of our competitors. It's driven purely by the players being a part of this phenomenon, being a part of this community. Everything that you've seen put on here from Mr. Spooky, Chris Segalia, to everybody here. Yeah. It's a group, a family coming together to help put on an amazing event. And you know, honestly, we can't do it either without all 150,000 or however many people out there who are watching. Thank you all for supporting us and uh, for being a part of this <laughs> phenomenon. And there is the man behind the plan. What, I mean, what, what's going on with Mr. Wizard? Yeah, just showing a big close-up of Mr. Wizard, but again, I mean, there's no reason for us to do this without all you guys at home. So, a part of Porcelain 4 Arena at Main Community, we'd like to present to you your waifu's harem. This is a surprise announcement here. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> a special gift here. For Mr. From Wizard. For, to Mr. Wizard from the Persona community. <laughs> You'll have to tell me about that one, I James. This is I a little outside of my wheelhouse. Yoko from Gurren Lagann. And, oh, of course, that. I believe that's known as a, as a love pillow. Hey, uh, is that correct? There, that is a spirit juice, a.k.a. It's called love pillow. Always keeping it classy here. Uh, that's one of my favorite things about this bunch. They're not above having fun. They're not above making fun of themselves. And, uh, you know, at times of uh, intense emotion, uh, Sometimes a little humor is the best cure. Shout out to Mr. Wizard uh, for okay, uh, everyone. this whole thing. How many first timers were here this evening? Please show hands. All right, let's, let's get a shot of this crowd here. Thank you all for coming. We love having you. How many veterans do we have there? Come on, get it up, James. Raise your hands. Thank you all for coming back. <laughs> With that, we close fun. the show. Thank you very much. We'll see you all next year. And how can you not believe that this is the premier event, the drama, the emotions, the craziness going on all weekend? The, I mean, the crowd chanting Evo. Uh, it's, it's like you script it, but it writes itself. It's, it's emerging just naturally. You just put amazing people in a room, have them duke it out. What rises to the top is just an incredible story that pulls so much emotion out of One of people. my favorite quotes from a very wise man once said that the legacy of Evo is just that we pulled it off every single year. <laughs> and, uh, you know, that you just build it and the hype will happen. And I believe that man was indeed yourself, Mr. Seth Killian. <laughs> James Chen. Get in here. Oh, my God. Love you, man. I love you all. Yeah, definitely. And um, Mr. Spooky sending us off. <laughs> best, I mean, this has been the most fantastic year. I, I, I think I we have, say that every year. Vince. I have no words for this, but... One hope, year we're going to blow it. I hope everybody at home enjoyed this as much as we did. Thanks, everybody, for tuning in for Evolution 2013. <laughs> exactly, exactly. We do it for you guys. Hope you enjoyed it. And I guess uh, Evo out, huh? See you next year.